New developments from San Antonio ISD's board meeting on Monday. They're giving an all or nothing ultimatum for Weston Urban, the developer of the proposed Mission Baseball Stadium, in a deal to purchase downtown school property. Ken's Fives Earl Stoudemire highlights what the district wants and when developers have to give an answer. Developers for the proposed Mission Stadium have until December 9th to decide if they want to work with what San Antonio ISD is proposing to make the ballpark land purchase possible. SAISD approved the proposal last night and they have five items they want done. Here are two of the big ones. The developers have to fund construction of a new building for SAISD's Advanced Learning Academy. This project costs an estimated $45 million. Another one is to guarantee affordable housing within the district attendance zones. The stadium plan would displace residents at the soap factory apartments. So in response, 55 people signed up to speak at the board meeting. A majority of them were against the stadium. I am here today not only to stand in solidarity with the residents of the soap factory apartment, but I am also here today because I am completely saddened and very disappointed in the city and in the school board for even agreeing to the idea of turn. You can accomplish what you want to do but there are better ways to do it. Please work with your business community and let's get this deal done. Other terms are to get paid $400,000 a year to compensate for the loss of property interest and get essential parking with safety measures to the Fox Tech campus. If the district doesn't want to pursue these terms for the land transfer, they have two other routes they can take. They can do a bid process to sell the property or they can make the property eminent domain to expand the Advanced Learning Academy. Again, Western Urban has until December 9th to make a decision. We'll keep you updated on this story. In the newsroom, Earl Stoudemire, Ken's 5.